everyone this is your Kalpana here in this video we are going to solve this differential equation so let's get started problem solve x square minus x plus y square into dx minus of y e power y minus 2xy into dy equals to 0 solution given differential equation x square minus x plus y square into dx minus of y into e power y minus 2xy into dy equals to 0. Which is all? m dx plus m dy equals to 0 form. Where by comparing these two, we will get m equals to this x square minus x plus y square and n equals to minus of y into e power y minus 2xy. If the partial derivative of m with respect to y is equal to partial derivative of n with respect to s, then we can say that the given differential equation is an exact equation. Let the given differential equation be 1. Okay. So now we can find the partial derivative of m with respect to y and partial derivative of n with respect to x. Do m by do y equals to do by do y of for m equals to x square minus x plus y square is equals to since we are doing partial derivative with respect to y so here x square x will be constant partial derivative of first term minus partial derivative of second term plus partial derivative of third term is equals to Partial derivative of constant with respect to y is 0 minus partial derivative of constant with respect to y is 0 plus partial derivative of y square with respect to y is 2y. So this equals to 2y. Therefore partial derivative of m with respect to y is 2y. Now let's find the partial derivative of n with respect to x do n by do x equals to do y do x of for n equals to minus of y into e power y minus 2xy is equals to do y do x of minus y into e power y minus minus into minus plus 2xy is equals to since we are doing partial derivative with respect to x so we'll treat y as constant. So here y, e power y are constants and here y and 2 are constants, right? This equals to minus partial derivative of first term plus partial derivative of second term. This equals to minus partial derivative of constant with respect to x is 0 plus constant into partial derivative of x with respect to x is equals to 2y into partial derivative of x with respect to x is 1 is equals to 2y. Therefore, Partial derivative of n with respect to x is 2y. Therefore, do m by do y equals to 2y equals to do n by do x. Therefore, do m by do y equals to do n by do x. Okay. Do m by do y equals to 2y. Again, 2y equals to do n by 2x. From this, we can say that do m by do y equals to do n by 
do x. So, rho m by dou y equals to dou m by dou x. From this, we can say that the given differential equation is an exact equation. Okay. Since the given equation is an exact equation, we know that the general solution of an exact equation is given by integral over x m into dx plus integral of terms of n free from x into dy equals to constant. So consider the first integral, integral over x, m into dx. Here we will be integrating m with respect to x, treating y as constant. This equals to integral of m for m equals to x square minus x plus y square into dx. Your y square is constant. This equals to integral x square dx minus integral x dx plus integral y square into dx. This equals to integral x square dx minus integral x dx plus Write the constant outside the integral. We can write the above as y square integral dx. This is equals to integral x square dx is x cubed by 3 minus integral x dx is x square by 2 plus y square into integral dx is x. So integral over x m into dx is x cubed by 3 minus x square by 2 plus x into y square. Now consider the second integral. Integral of terms of n free from x into dy. We are having n equals to minus y e power y plus 2xy, right? Terms which are free from x is minus y into e power y. This equals to integral of minus y into e power y into dy. You can write this as minus integral y into e power y into dy. We can solve this using Bernoulli's equation. Let u equals to y and dv equals to e power y into dy. We know that integral u into dv is equals to uv minus u dash v1 plus u double dash v2 and so on. Minus plus and so on, right? u dash equals to y dash 1 u double dash equals to 0. Integral dv equals to integral e power y into dy. From this we will get v equals to e power y. Now find v1. v1 equals to integral, integral e power y dy equals to integral e power y dy is again e power y. Okay. So now you're having u dash equals to 0, right? So we'll neglect the terms from here. So we'll have only the first two terms. uv minus u dash v1. So this becomes or this one. Minus of Integral y into e power y is u v y into e 
power y minus u dash 1 into v1 v power y which is equals to minus y into e power y minus into minus plus e power y. Okay. So integral of terms of entry from x into dy is minus y into e power y plus e power y. Coming to the general solution of 1, therefore, the general solution of 1 is result obtained from the first integral x cubed by 3 minus x square by 2 plus xy square plus result obtained from the second integral it is minus y into e power y plus e power y equals to constant. Then, take the LCM of 3, 2. Three the six. The numerator will get two x square minus three set this cube minus three x square plus six x y square minus six y into e power y plus six e power y equals to constant. Then, 2 into x cube minus 3x square plus 6xy square minus 6y into e power y plus 6 into e power y equals to 6c. Since c being constant, you can write 6c as c. Then, 2x cube minus 3x square plus 6xy square minus 6y into e power y plus 6 into e power y equals to c is the required solution. You can also take 6 into e power y common from these two terms or minus 6 into e power y common from these two terms and we will get 2x cube minus 3x square plus 6xy square minus or sorry minus 6 into e power y times y minus 1 equals to c. Minus 6 e power y into y is minus 6 y e power y. Okay. Minus into minus plus 6 e power y into 1 is 6 e power y. Okay. Fine. So we have seen a problem from exact equation in this video. Hope you will understand. We will see you in the next video. Until then. Bye bye.